Different day, different shirts. We are on part two of our Christmas quest of decorating. We will be out for, what are we looking for? Dog Nico. Food. So we're gonna go get dog food because this one eats a lot, he's a growing boy. Oh, Jesus, my, <laughs> my tripod can't support my camera. Okay, so. Uh, uh, we need dog food, we need uh, ink. Oh yeah, we, we uh, bought a printer for Black Friday, which is a weird Black Friday purchase now that I think of it. But we need printer and ink for that because we got documents of the secret variety. Printer paper, not printer. We already have a printer. Oh, that's what I meant to say. <laughs> printer paper. And to buy Christmas decorations for the house. Right. Anything else? No, that's it. I feel so big. I feel so big. Bleep that out. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. I need this. One thing that's not on our list, that's now on our cart. Love it. What is this? <gasps> what is this? So it just has a shirt, that's it? That includes a t shirt. <gasps> this one comes with the pot figure, too. This is on our list, but we're getting it. What is it? It's a DD adventure. What is it, a book or what? Should I get this? Why not? Because you have that one. And you also shouldn't even get that one because you already have a pot figure. But I want that one. So I'll put this one back. What's best boss? Oh, look, little figurines. Xenoblade. Xenomorph. You haven't no. seen any of the alien movies, huh? I saw one with you and Carla. Of Alien? Wasn't there Alien that we watched at the movie theaters? No. Was it a scary movie? It wasn't scary. It was no. about an alien. Like the 1980s movies I'm talking about. Like Alien 1 and 2. Like the movie is just called Alien. Oh, dude, these are awesome. Look. Freddy. Freddy. <laughs> They're pretty cougar shots. So it only makes sense that I get the Freddy Cougar. No. Okay, so we came for ink, but obviously he's a little distracted. And look at that. Got the last one. One thing done out of our checklist while well, he's still distracted. Okay, so we're getting this little, what is this babe, bison? Hell yeah. Little bison. It's a North American buffalo. This cute little snowflake. Snowman. And as of right now, we have kind of a Star Wars theme going on. And then what I didn't film is we also got some games. That sounds, um, sounds fun. And then we also got Incoherent. Which is really fun. Because we played this game with this family once, and uh, it was really fun. Basically, the card has, like, words that are misspelled or whatever, and you're supposed to figure out what it's saying, and then see, that's the back of the card. There's your Thursday. It gives you a hint and, like, a little sentence or whatever, and you can play as teams. It's pretty fun. But, yeah. I like fun. <laughs> Okay. Alright guys, so we're back from Target. We got a couple of things there. Um, we showed you a couple of them when we were there. So we got these little tins, tinsel garlands. Just because our tree looks very naked and we need to fill it up with some stuff. Shiny sh which is good to distract people from the lack of ornaments we're gonna have. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty. They're pretty, pretty and shiny. Let's see, oh, we also got Except for our printer that we bought, paper. We bought it at Dunder Mifflin. <laughs> and a little ink. Why is ink so goddamn expensive? I, I forget every time I buy ink, and I'm surprised every time I look at the prices of ink. 50 bucks, stupid. I print one picture out, and it's my whole cartridge. Also, this is the printer we got on Black Friday. This bad boy fits so much printing on it. This little 
slow feeder for our dog Nico because he eats way too fast. Yeah, he's also a very excited breed, so we need something for him to kind of concentrate on to yeah. stimulate him a little bit. This is Fabi's guilty purchase. I am a sucker for the office. It's a little Dwight moment. I already have one that I got one for my birthday, but it's a different maker. This is NBC made this. So we got the games that we bought from Target. These are gonna be good for a Christmas party that we put on hopefully. So that's that. That's our yep. quick Target haul. Yep, now we just have to get this printer out of its box and uh... decorate the tree. Yep. I guess that'll be manuals. Don't need that. This is only sure that I keep. I got it all by myself without help. So it actually did come with ink. So um, yeah. Oh. <laughs> So now we have a working printer. It works. Yay! Okay, so we got a couple cool stuff actually. So here's a little BB-8 for the tree. And then my personal favorite, R2-D2. And of course we have to have Yoda. It made me sad because there's no baby Yoda ones out yet. Okay, and then of course we already showed Chewbacca. Add to the tree. And it's then up. we have oh. these little blue ornaments going on simply because most of the things at the house are blue. I don't know. Matching. That's what we're into. And that's our tree. You've already seen it. But just an another quick look at our rinky dink little tree that we gotta spruce up a bit. And we still need to find the um, the tree skirt. I feel like it's gonna look weird without it. It's because it's naked. Look, look how naked it is. You can see it's stump, I guess. I don't know what you would call that. They really make these things childproof. I'm not gonna lie, it's very difficult to open. I'm getting a little frustrated at this point. I got it. Ah! Hi. These are my ornaments. They're pretty. Like my girlfriend. Aww. I just realized we didn't buy string or hooks. It doesn't come with hooks? <laughs> no. God, we're so new at this. I have paper clips. Wait, we can still hook them up though because of... You just put it through here. No. No, it doesn't fit. Oh, it's not gonna have I have paper clips though. So. Still trying to eat. It's working guys. It's really slowing him down. And soon it'll starve him. No, it won't. <laughs> and this is actually really good for him because it's stimulating his little brain. All right, Mr. DIY, how are you going to use those paper clips? So those paper clips are going to be hooked onto this, which will be hooked onto the tree, sir. I mean, ma'am. Sorry. Show me. Oh. You grab your paper clip. You give it a little hook a -roo hook look like that. Then. You grab your ornament, pass it through the small hook, like so. And then your big hook shall go on the tree like this, c'est moi. Magnifique. And now I just gotta do that for all of them. So how about I set up the paper clip, you hang them up however you want to. Oh dear. Sir! Jesus Christ. <laughs> He's like, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Look how pretty he is. God, I love him. He's like, no!
There's the rest of the tree. I like how it turned out. I think it's very pretty, very classy. Good for a starter tree, in my opinion. It is. Go stand next to it, dude. A beautiful tree. We need more Star Wars stuff. Yeah, because as of right now, all we have is a uh, little Yoda, R2, Chewbacca, and BB-8. And I think we're going to go all out with the Star Wars thing this year. I think we are too. But as of now, it's a very classy looking tree. And I think it's we a need, good way. We need more of this. The little white thistle? Yeah, for this bottom. Oh, a tree? Huh? Oh, our star is crooked. Ain't no crooked stars in my house. Not in Casa Gonzalez. Nope. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let your friends know. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. <laughs>